Kill all the dudes! Kill all the dudes! Right now! Hello friends, my name is Brandon Dayton, I'm your humble narrator, and welcome to Butcher. A side-scrolling shoot 'em up it's pretty awesome, lots of blood to be had. Made by Transhuman Design, who created Soldat, which is a game that I played a hell of a lot when I was a little tiny kitty. Uh, we got to say a game in progress, but I don't need to finish that shit. And uh, let's let's try the mediumist difficulty and see how that goes. I've played this game for a few minutes before. I know there are three levels, eight weapons, a uh, variety of enemies, but I will be officially dipping my toes into the uh, harder difficulty. So let's see how we might do. Oh, lots of meaty chunks raining from the sky. Everybody likes that. Oh God, please don't hurt me. Oh God! How much damage do they do? I think it was like seven? Some crazy shit? I don't, I don't deserve this. <laughs> so obviously uh, the UI is pretty cool. The pixelated design is really enjoyable. Oh god, please. Oh god damn it, shit! <laughs> oh. And you have to be really accurate with your weapons, which is similar to Soldat. Um, really, really tight. I'm super scared. Oh my god, they just ate that guy on the cross. They ate Jesus! The crows ate Jesus! Oh, these dudes. The birds were trying to eat him. Holy shit. Holy shit! Oosh! I'll save you, birds! Please don't kill me! <laughs> the door's locked. The door's locked. The door's locked! Reload, reload, reload! Boosh! Yeah! That's nice. <laughs> it's really twitchy, really pixelated, really uh, bloody, which is basically what got me into Hotline Miami wanting to let's play that. So when I saw this, I was like, hell yeah, we're gonna take a bite out of that. Killed four humans, 14 non-humans, 18 items, which I assume are like health and shields and weapons. Acid factory. Wonderful. So yeah, this game is definitely not as colorful as something like Hotline Miami, but uh, it has a nice aesthetic to it. It's like kind of doomy and like futuristic is what I mean by doomy. <laughs> Not just like Doom as in an adjective, but Doom as in the noun, the game. You know, that Space Marine guy. I think this is a little Space Marine guy too. Jesus. Please don't hurt me. Please don't hurt me. Oh wow. He got like strung up somehow. And then I blew him into little meaty chunks and put him out of his misery. Oh, the fire hurts. Don't get in the fire because the fire hurts. And what else do we got? Oh, we got a new weapon, not just the pistol and the shotgun. Now we have a rifle. An automatic rifle. Everybody likes that, don't they? Wow. Chain explosions. That's pretty cool. Gotta kill all the dudes. Kill all the dudes. Kill all the dudes. Right now. Damn. Lost all my armor pretty quick there. Uh, let's hit this thing. What does this do? Oh god, I blew myself up with a fucking grenade. Yep, certainly. We'll put that away for later. I'll stick with my shotgun. It seems the safest. Oh, the door's open! The door's open! Oh, what the fuck? Trolley. Trolley, trolley. They make good gummy candies. <laughs> oh! Dude, that fucking guy just killed his own bro. Am I like in some kind of just random slaughterhouse? The dudes with guns don't kill each other, but that psycho with the knife uh, killed his bro, for sure. Oh, the door's open. Oh God, please leave me alone. Knife psycho. <laughs> oh no, why, why are you doing this? Oh, this guy. Oh, all right, we're making it. We're somehow making it. Oh, elevator, okay. <coughs> and of course, enemies on the elevator because always enemies on the fucking elevator. It's all right. I dispatched them post haste. And I think we're doing pretty good. I'd like to see what this is like on uh, the hardest difficulty. But yeah, it, it's pretty difficult even on the normal difficulty. So I don't know. Was I supposed to do that? Did I make a stupid? Oh God, please no! These fucking murder guys. 
They're terrifying! I think it's mostly the screaming. They just scream like psychos and then run after you. Ooh, nice armor. Nice armor, bro. That guy got me. You're not gonna get me. Nobody can get me. And the blood drips down the walls. So cool. Really, really nice work on this game. Uh, I don't think I can jump across that. Probably not. We'll go down. I think down's where you're supposed to go. And this looks like another elevator, but I can't... Oh, I can't kick. But I can't kick the door down. So we will continue on. Boosh! What's up, motherfucker? He didn't even see it coming. It was so sad. He didn't even see it coming. Should reload the shotgun. Ah, uh, and now there's a switch by the elevator. It was hidden in the wall. And I got the card key. I guess it was a card key. Or something. A magnetic device. I really like how he, uh, how he looks around in the uh, six directions, eight directions, whatever the fuck it is. Hooray, another level down. Took us three minutes. That's not too bad. So let's not frown. 60 items. Yes. I really want this this to be a full game. We'll go to the Room of Pleasures, which is the next level and the last level, unfortunately. This little Space Marine guy is going to have a battle with a saw blade. This is normal. This is normal! Oh, and I picked up a new weapon, too. You can see it on the bottom there. Oh, it's a chain gun! It's a chain gun! That's fucking cool. Oh! The fucking saw was dragging that guy around somehow. Is that his intestines, perhaps? Perhaps it is. Yay, barely! His intestines! Alright, just gotta be sure we don't get fucked. Have I picked up more weapons? Grenade launcher! Jesus Christ. Please don't hurt me! Are we supposed to kill the saw? Is that what I'm to understand? Ooh, I think I hurt myself there. Die! 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 It's not dying. I don't know why it's not dying. I think he just blew up one of those flying, exploding guys. Woo! And then again, woo! Oh, that's so nice. How do I open the fucking door? Huh? Somebody answer my question! Wow, that is a lot of blood. There will be blood. Oh, look, the door's open. Oh, shit! God, fuck me! <sighs> I just farted around for too long. I'm sorry. Alright, we'll do it for reals this time. Oh, the blood stays, too, after you die. So you can really paint this room. We're painting the rose, it's red. We're painting the rose, it's red. Oh, it's a good thing we stalled, because this is another item. A fucking flamethrower! <laughs> That's so awesome! Are you kidding? It does cauterize the, the wound immediately, so you're not going to be able to enjoy the, uh, the streaks of blood that you were able to previously. But, you know, sacrifices. Sacrifices must be made. Boosh! Drop down, nail that guy, get a rocket launcher, nail the other fucking guy. Oh, please die. Please die, please die. It's not a rocket launcher, it's a chain gun. I'm sure they do have a rocket launcher, don't they? Yeah, get dragged around by your intestines, kid. That's how I discipline my children. <laughs> oh my god, what the fuck is this? A rail gun? Damn, that is cool. Holy shit. Oh, and the door's open, so we better go. But look at this. Whoa, and it punches fucking holes and things. Damn. You can fucking get people through walls. I really want to see some multiplayer on this. This is like sold out on crack, man. Oh. Definitely check out the... Uh, the demo, the link is in the description. It's on itch.io, and this is the end of the demo, unfortunately. <sighs> I do hope you've enjoyed, friends. I cannot wait to see this thing come to a full release. Definitely, definitely check it out. Look at that fucking satyr, center, uh, metal goat leg guy with his shotgun. 
<laughs> that picture alone is enough to make me throw some money at this game. I do hope you've enjoyed the episode. If you did, I hope you'll like, comment, and or subscribe, friends. This has been Butcher by Transhuman Design. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. And I hope to see you in the next one, friends. Until then, bye bye one, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.